What is up, guys? Deedsy. Courtney's dead. And today we are bringing you episode 32 in Dead Frontier, and we will be bringing you a mission from Nasty Earth Holding. For a lot of you guys that obviously haven't been here in a while, or for some of you new players that are literally just starting out, and you're like, are the missions any good? Um, okay. I'm working on my WSAD. So, so, is that what gamers <laughs> call it? W -A ASD? Yeah. Am I saying that right? If you bring your map up as well, we'll get a look at where we should go for during this mission, because I don't have a clue okay. either. Okay. You picked up a mission. It's the reunion for a cash reward of 750 and experience of 2500 So that's not bad. So it looks like we have to go. We're probably going to go down three blocks and over three blocks or four blocks. Okay. So if you walk backwards and down, it'll probably be the easiest one. From where we came out and then just down. Okay. You're used to playing mass. I am. Yeah. Check out our other gameplays because that's what I keep wanting to put my hands to play for. Okay, so three down and three over. Yeah. And to kill some zombies. Woo -hoo -hoo. I'm a zombie killer. I can't walk great, but I kill zombies. Oh. You. you better mind your own business. My mission's just starting. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna spare you your light this time. I'm gonna try to draw the least attention as possible. So I remember back in the day as well, guys, that uh, they didn't even have missions in Dead Frontier. Um, I did try it out when it was like, I was about to call it 2D. I think it was actually. But regardless, they, they used to not even have missions. They used to just walk around slaying zombies and looting and grinding. Uh, so I do like the, uh... Yes, I think I still have some of those. The mission, you do. So you can sell them. Like yeah. I said, bullets are like cigarettes. And, <laughs> uh... Again, I remember when there were no missions, and so you just walked around and looted and grinded your way to whatever you could. I wouldn't think you've got a lot of food. I do have a lot of food, guys. As you can see, I bought a new gun, as per some help. Since I'm a little green to the whole gun game. We gotta get her some uh, some bonus stuff, some mastercraft stuff at some point. But for now, we needed something that did a little bit more damage. Everyone, just mind your own business. Nothing to see here. I really want to test out my new gun, but I'm gonna take the opportunity. I would save your energy because it looks like I saw a flaming boss. What? Possibly Where? gonna run towards you. I'm not sure. Why would you walk Come towards him? Oh. He yeah. runs fast. Yeah, he runs fast. That's why I said save your energy. So with him, you can kite him. Like, he has to stop to hit you. So then, like, you know what I mean? You wait yeah. a second and then run backwards. Uh, he he is going to take a while to kill. So I should just run away from him? Unless you want to stay and kill him. It's completely up to you. We can change the episode from a mission to a you slaying this boss. Well, people see these all the time. No one wants to see my rookie ass. It's up to you. By the way, so off camera, I guess if we're not playing, those guys will always drop. They're like the regular bosses. They will always Aww. drop a item. So at a lower level, guys, if you see those and you're not trying to do a mission, because we did say we were, I guess, going to try to attempt to complete this mission. <clears throat> um, at a lower level, when you try to fight those guys, uh, once you slay them, you they drop items for you. I'm sad now. Oh, oh that's a street post. It is. Need some better street lights up in here, folks. What are our taxes paying for? Zombies? Jeez. Ironically, I think it's the apocalypse day. And we can't have anything nice here. By the way, at the end of the street, we should pull up our map quick and see how close we are. I think we've only gone two down, right? Yeah. Okay. And you're running on empty. Aw. That's okay, I like to do cute songs to remind you so it doesn't sound sound negative. I don't sound like a backseat dead frontier player. A backseat dead frontier player. Nobody likes those. Look at you, just it's picking money. up cash. I do like money. Money! Makes the world go round. Cash moves everything around me. We'll see, I think... That's three down? I believe. Bring your map up. Stay up around here for a second. This is another tip I found. Maybe I'm just a chicken if you bring your map up near like if you stay no like if you stay around here because when you bring your map up when you, after you close it they'll all run towards you yeah so go go up go back up and then keep walking to the right okay 
See? So after you close your map, you draw aggro. So I always try to stay near the top of the street, so after I drop my map, I can just run back up. Makes sense. Good to know. So we're going this way. Do, 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 do. Do and then you'll know when you're in the mission area, on the left-hand side of the screen, like, orange text will pop up, like, whatever you're supposed to do in the mission. So in okay. this one, we're supposed to find Katie's father. I did do one where I had to find people out in the streets or something. You did. You had to find, like, four like soldiers or something or... like that. Okay. Yeah. It was like a blog party. I had to find the people that went missing. Search, search, search faster. Thank you. I'm very confident about that. You, that was a very cocky move. I probably shouldn't have done that, but I had faith. You should wait till later on after you start playing for a while and you just try to dance around and then search at the same time. <laughs> not that good at walking yet. Sometimes that goes well. Sometimes that does not go well at all. It's a 50-50. Yet. Fact. Works 50% of the time every, every time. time. Wanna search this body? Damn this it. Is junk. I know the point of our mission wasn't to loot, but sometimes it is ni nice to get some loot. I'm gonna shoot you. Look at you, Savage. I wouldn't waste your ammo. I'm gonna save it for the zombies that are gonna be coming up. That's true. I just wanted to shoot one. I wanted to test my gun. And it's awesome. It's better than the Beta Tomcat or the Beta 8000. I think I keep calling For the sure. Beta Tomcat. Maybe there is two of them, and I'm actually. Maybe you find the 9mm bullets. There's also a map we can check as well that tells you where, which area you're most likely to find stuff. Oh, that's cool. So you can go like, oh, I want to go like eight blocks up because I'm more likely to find like this type of ammo. No dog biscuits for me. If Mika was in the video game, I would. Oh, I walked her into I was about to say, what are you doing there? My walking skills are less than admirable. And that's okay. It's work in progress. Alright. Hopefully. Is it this block? No, it must be the next one. Adios, We're getting there. Muchachos. We're getting there, guys. Whee, I'm running. I'll stop running. I don't know if that happens to you guys. It happens to me all the time in Dead Frontier. I'll go Whee. and be like, I'm going to go do this certain thing, and then I end up getting distracted and doing other. Leave me alone, lady. I want to search this. Leave me alone. I would walk away. Oh, that bitch. Look at him. I don't think he got the memo that car was on fire. Oh, look at that. Two bodies right next to each other. You're bound to find the useless junk here. Fact. Oh, there you okay, go. Okay, I'll take that. Scary strips on the go. There we right. go. There we are, folks. Hopefully. I think. Yep. Yep. So Where is Katie's we... family? Should you go up and then down and then, you know what I mean? How like the blocks are normally. You tell me. Yeah, I would go up first. Okay, I will. Because I don't know exactly where he is. He. And is there not a whole family? No, he was finding her father. Oh, my bad. And maybe that's the only family she's left. Probably after this godforsaken apocalypse. I think that's him up ahead, actually. Of course, like, I'm going to leave this body first. I'm going to know it. I, I think, or maybe I'm seeing things. I think I'm seeing a green. It's too far away. Katie's dad. Nope. Hey, have you seen a little girl around here? No. Huh? You mean she's okay? okay so Thank yeah. God. Yeah, stay with him and then help him fight off the zombies. I thought she was dead. You know, zombies with you, my new friend. No, the rest of my family didn't make it. Katie and I are the only ones left now. So he's oh. talking to himself. We don't even have a dialogue bubble. We're just like, yeah. Our I silence fear. tells you everything. If I had known she was at the holdout, I would have gone there days ago. 
He's like glitching into them. Like, what are you doing, fella? Well, no use hanging around here. I'm heading to the holdup to see my daughter. I don't blame you. You should. I encourage you. Okay, so you're shooting him in the back, probably, so I... Oh. Yeah. There you go, That's mission it? complete. There we go, look how easy that was. Alright, so what I would do now is... You can head up with them and then head all the way left till you hit a wall and go all the way up. Mission complete. Look at that, Damn. guys. Oh, you're natural. Block with the car. <laughs> I'm learning. I learned from good teacher. <laughs> Rusty. Rusty teacher. And it's totally up to you if on the way back if you want to slay a few zombies to get some extra experience while you're walking by. I totally will. I want to find find another flaming guy. Kill you. Uh, if you move fast enough, he will be up in the same spot. So if you get going left and then up again. Uh, that's a, oh, oh, the dog wants some dog biscuits. I hate, I hate the friggin' dogs. You should be able to take the dog biscuits and tempt the zombie dogs with them. Well, now the zombie dogs want brains. I know. They're past so. the biscuit stage. They're onto the hard stuff. Oh, you got, your shotgun. You got your shotgun out there. You can sell your nails and stuff probably in nasty house for a chunk of money. Good. Good. I like that. The markets are so different now. I was going to say, a lot of the weapons, as we found, were way more expensive at Nasty House, um, as opposed to, like, the Sekronon Bunker, where people find weapons left, right, and center. And that's fair. Yeah. I'm going fast. Are you Ricky Bobby? Be a double entendre episode. Mission passed and killed flaming zombie. Search a couple bars. Do some stuff. If you start running low on energy with the flaming zombie, the shotgun should knock him back a little bit. Okay. But it also draws aggro to you too as well. Mm -hmm. So then I got more to deal with. Just get out of here real quick. How far over did we go? Holy wow. I feel like I've been traveling forever. I'm I know, journeyman. that's the thing it did, Frontier. Woo! Later. You're running on empty. I don't have time right now, car. Should I? I want to get that flaming zombie. He'll be my first. He'll be your first flaming zombie taken down? Yeah. Oh, so many cars, though. I'll switch this one. See, that's what gets you to a dead frontier every time. Like you're uh -oh. not gonna, you're not gonna not. It could be that iron sight. Exactly. I don't think you can actually get it to level ten. That's why I tease. Okay, but I'm all the way over now. Should I go down or up? Uh, I go down. Like walk around here for a second, see if he pops up, or maybe actually go up. Shoot your shotgun off at these guys. Stay in this area for a second. Shoot it off. Because I was right well, at them. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. I was bang, facing bang. the wrong way. <laughs> and then that'll dry aggro. See if the uh, the flaming zombie comes. And if, if he doesn't come within like 30 seconds, just go to the next. Keep going up. Come at me, bro. Come get me. Alright, I would go up. He doesn't look like he's showing up to fight. Or maybe he he's was up, up in the next block. We're gonna find this guy. The zombie. You wait. Blasting shotgun rounds like it's nobody's business. Come get me, flaming zombie. I got a message for you. There he is. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're all top till he shows up, and then it was. I forget how fast he runs. 
Oh, I'm stuck on the fence. Yeah, I was going to say. Make I, would do, I would loop back down. I would loop back down. Oop, too many loops. Too much looping. I love that he takes a second to hit. Like, I always have time to get away. I know, and you know what that is? Agility, and that's why it's super friggin' key that that'd be the first thing that everybody maxes out. So keep that in mind, guys. First thing you want to max out is agility. So that you can literally walk and do this. Now, it is key to run away sometimes. Or power. Like, get it, yeah, out of the way of that. Where are you going? Come at me. Oh, you're getting cocky. Oh, see? The things can change. <laughs> this is kind of uh, nerve wracking, I'm not going to lie. You know how many bullets sure, this guy takes is crazy. Oh, yeah, for sure. Make sure zombies don't get in front of him either because sometimes he'll push them towards you. You oh, know what really? I mean? Yeah. And then they get the hit even though they shouldn't. I would loop back down because if you keep walking up, you're going to drop more aggro. Like other from other zombies that are already alive up there. Oh, okay. So, yeah. The thing that I always accidentally That's my forget. Crew. I would run, like run down. There you go. See, because they're not as fast as you. There you go. Then you can walk. Pump that guy full of lead. Woo! Take that. Shotgun shells for your troubles. Car there. You'll know that he'll start to die when he starts to lose. Limbs? Like limbs and starts to get less bright. As silly as that sounds. Like his fire. Yeah, like burns his fire out. starts to get like dimmer and dimmer. Everyone came to party. It's a block party. Not as good as Dave Chappelle's. Eric Badu's not here, but we got a flaming zombie and we're kicking his ass. I know, that's the thing too. When you're first starting out and you get a flaming zombie, oh man, it takes forever to kill. Also, you'll get a buttload of experience from them, so that's a good. good thing. It's taking like 100 shotgun rounds. Try your pistol on them then. See, you getting dimmer and dimmer. I'd go back down. Take that. Let's switch back to your shotgun. Is better? Cheaper rounds as well. Touche. <laughs> Not for you. Get out of here, bud. Swap that. This guy just takes a beat. Does he ever? This is great practice for your movement, though. This is true. Because he moves faster than a normal zombie. And this is like your first taste of the boss as well. This is considered a boss at Nasty House. Okay, good. Shout out to our friend in the comments. I'm practicing my WASD. I'm working on it. I'm getting better, see? I'll get there. There we go. He lost an arm. Did you see that? Yeah. Later to your limbs. Shotgun bullets are bad for your health. See, you're losing 
how do you lose the second when arm? When you do that, when you do that walking thing, if you hit shift with it, like time it with shift, it'll do like, yeah, like a little speed boost thing. There goes his head. Yeah, I go back down so you don't go into the next block by accident. Oh, pull. I hate pulls. I get, the worst. I get back onto the street then so you don't walk into another one. I love pulls. I lied. Pokey Dinah. He just won't stop. I kill that dog when you get a chance. I'm trying. There we go. Sorry. He kept getting in my way. Ooh, take that. Oh, he's got to go down soon, Hulky Dinah. Right. Searching. Yeah, guys. Oh, not a sports sermon. Well, think about it this way: you, you got a bunch free of experience money. from them. That's true. And a free sports armor that you can throw in the scrapyard. Oh, but all right, guys, let's make it back to base and complete this mission. I've been eyeing these cars up, and honestly, it hurt me not being able to search them while I was shooting him. <laughs> Yes, you do have to finish. Tattered pages. What do they do? Uh, I guess take them. And then worst case scenario, just scrap them. They're, uh, they're obviously for another mission. Hmm. Probably. So I can potentially have another mission done? Already? It'd probably be collect more than just one tattered page. It'd probably be like oh. four, six, eight, something like that, but... But yes, the missions, guys, are a great way, obviously, to increase your experience there and fly up the ranks. I love experience. I'm going to kill some more zombies on my way. Why not? <laughs> Especially you. Oh, there you go. Keep that. And that. And that. Bye. I just think of the Bill Burr thing with the shotguns. Like, you got a problem over there? You don't got a problem over there anymore. Woo! Boom. Mission complete, guys. Bam! Right on. That's what's up. Perfect. Yes. 750 bucks. Alrighty, so what do we want to put yeah, your points in? Pistols. And agility because I like agility. Yes. Alrighty, and we I are. my first boss. Do, do, what, do, do, a quarter do. of the way. We are a quarter of the way there, guys, to leveling up again. So, level 11, as you can see, we're doing this. So, thanks for tuning in again, guys. Don't forget to like, rate, comment, and subscribe. We're going to be bringing you, obviously, daily, for the most part, daily, Dead Frontier videos. And uh, hopefully we start getting some incredible rare loot as well, guys. That would be quite tight waffle. Definitely check out our Massachusetts gameplay. That game's really cool as well. Yeah, we got we've got a bunch of other... Yeah, we've got a bunch Don't of other... Don't forget to subscribe. Oh. That's karma. Good, that, that is karma. Thanks. We do have a bunch of other cool videos that you guys can check out. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. This has been a Hippie Thug production. Peace, love. Hippie Thug.